Yo, it's your boy D's Media back again with another video. Like, comment, subscribe to the channel on the road to 100K. Today, we're going to talk about THF Bezu. Another clip from his No Jumper interview dropped. And uh, he was speaking on um, him serving four and a half years in prison for the uh, the murder case that he ended up beating. If y'all go back and remember, remember him and Vaughn beat. Uh, they both beat murders, I think, like a month or two apart. And they dropped that song, uh, Beat a Body. But pretty much he was explaining it without really going into details what happened. Um, you could know, it, you could pretty much tell it was a touchy situation because he pretty much was saying that um, his oldest two daughters, mother, husband, is the one that snitched on him and ultimately led him uh, doing four and a half years in, in Cook County Jail before ultimately getting found not guilty uh, by, the, by the blessings of God. Uh, but... Um, that's a tough situation to be in, man, you know, because you got to think. It's like your your oldest daughter's stepdad is the one that told on you and got you locked up. So, you know what I'm saying? So it's like your baby mom's husband. You can't, can't really touch him because you may be affecting your daughters. You never know the relationship that your daughters then built with this man. Then two on that. It's like, it's like you got a damn nerve for four and a half years. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta be like, damn, this man raising my daughters and he the reason why I'm in here, you know? And your, your kids probably resent you or hate you because you're not there for Christmas or for their birthdays or however the case may be. Not saying that Zoo went taking care of his kids because he got money, so I'm pretty sure, but money don't really make up for the, for, for the times and the, the memories, you know? Money only could buy you materialistic stuff that you gonna throw away or outgrow. But um, pretty much, man, um, you know, you could tell that it was an emotional story because he told he told uh, Adam 22 he really don't want to get into it too much, but he just was saying that, you know, and certain blocks be harboring fugitives and they know they out here doing bogus shit. And he felt like, you know, like motherfuckers ain't never expose him or put him on blast or nothing like that. But at the end of the day, he know that that's his baby mom's husband. He know that this man is part of his two daughters' life. So it's like, what can you really do? You know, you, you, you can't harm the man, can't hurt him. You know, because like I say, once again, that's your baby mom's husband. And he also was around your daughters. So it's like your daughters may look at him like a stepdad or whatever. So it's like a situation that you got to... You got to damn near let go. You know what I'm saying? Zeus served his time. He beat the he beat the homicide. Um, thank thank God. So you know it's a blessing in itself. So it's like why um I guess why why keep worrying about it or or, or or why try to push the envelope on that situation? But man, that's some that's some tough shit to be in. Just imagine, bro, if you get locked up for a body and you found out the person that's snitching on you is your baby mom's husband. You know what I'm saying? On top of that, he around your kids. You get what I'm saying? So, like I say, Zoo didn't really go too much into it. Um, but like I say, that was just the main part of the story that I wanted to share. Uh, like I say, man, uh, my condolences go out to the victim that lost his life, his family. Um, we don't never want to skip over that because somebody did lose their life. Uh, so definitely condolences go out to that person family uh also got to give zoo uh bezu his props man for you know just 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 developing and growing man into a demand that we see today you know he's starting to realize that uh he don't have to he don't have to he don't have to he don't have to man be be a hood figure or or or, or a block nigga or a nigga out there that oh yeah he the realest motherfucker ever bro you know, he realizing now that the goal in life is to get this money, take care of your family, take care of your kids. Because when you look up, like Zeus said, he didn't get a system 12 years of his life. If his daughter is only, if his oldest child is 16, then that mean what? Majority of his kid's life, he been gone. If he got his child that's, what, seven, eight years old? Shit, he did four. Then think about it, man. He missed all his kids' life, man. I think at this point, man, Zoo want to rap, man. He want to get some money, man. And 
he want to take advantage of this blessing that he got, man, by his, his homie being one of the biggest rappers in the world, man. So take advantage of that junk zoo and more credit to you, man, for, for growing up, man, and, and realizing that it, it's, it, it's bigger than just sliding and gliding. But it's your boy D's Media signing out. Y'all let me know what y'all think.